have no excuse other than allergies. Uh, but today we're gonna go hiking and go about an hour and a half away from my apartment and go see some waterfalls and fall colors and maybe grab a German pretzel and some hot chocolate or two. And then because this is a reading channel, we of course have to do a 24 hour reading vlog while we do this. Oh, well, it's not necessarily a full 24 hours. Well, um, I'm gonna be reading Gideon the Ninth today. I have it both as an audiobook and the physical copy. This is my second time rereading this. Um, the first time I actually ended up DNFing it about two or a hundred pages before the end because it ended up being something very, very different than what I thought it was. I was a little annoyed about it. Um, but now that I know what it is and I actually have a sequel sitting on my nightstand that I picked up from the library the other day, I'm gonna give it a go and hopefully understand a little bit better about what all the hype is because everybody seems to really love this book and I liked the characters the last time I read it. I just had a, a lot of issues with the plot being what it was, but that's not going to be an issue this time around and I'll update you guys once there's something to update. All right, gang, I have had my coffee and we're gonna head on out. Nala's sad that she doesn't get to come with us. She wants to though. She's not a hiker. All right, Peach, you ready to go on an adventure? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Alrighty, here we go, guys. Let's go. Okay, so um, the pretzel thing turned out to be a fail because they wanted like twenty dollars for their pretzels. And I'm like, I'm broke. So I might come back in a little bit after we go hiking and get some postcards once Peach settles down a little bit more. Um, I do wanna get to the waterfall before it gets too hot and too late in the day. Um, so I came over to downtown Helen and got some cash for parking. We're gonna go do that now. And then we might come back here, like I said, and I'll try to get a shot of downtown when I drive back through here. But for now, let's go. I'm sure you can hear. Oh, look at the pretty trees. And the dog is having the time of her life. She's like yanking me down the trail. She is so excited to be here. It's like the absolute perfect temperature, and it just finished raining, so it's like a little on the foggy side, and it's just perfect.
have made it home from hiking and I am so tired. <laughs> I ended up stopping for milkshakes um, and then I did not ever get my pretzel and hot chocolate but I got a chocolate milkshake that tasted like chocolate pudding only had a milkshake and it was delicious. So I can't complain. Say hi. <laughs> anyway. Um, it hit me on the drive home that I apparently go up there this time, or I went up there this time last year, and it's just such an interesting thing to think about, because this time last year I was recovering from a massive car accident where I broke my knee, and like, I could barely walk going into that adventure to waterfalls last year and then like somehow between the stairs and everything it like shifted my knee back into place that was an emotional mess this time last year too I'm still not in a great emotional state but i'm definitely doing a lot better um and this hike today really helped with a lot of that and it was gorgeous and it was really nice to get out and see some fall colors and it was so pretty it was like 70 degrees the whole time we were out there peach had a blast she is like meant to be a trail dog and she got so many compliments, like, everybody we passed, they're like, oh, pretty dog, and she got to interact with a lot of little kids today, which is, like, her favorite thing in the entire world. I didn't get as much reading done as I thought I was going to, because I had no signal out at the waterfall, and I f was dumb and forgot to <laughs> download the audiobook before I headed out, and so it was streaming off cell service the whole time. So once all service cut out, I couldn't listen to it. But I think I got about seven or eight chapters into it beforehand. And like I said, this is a reread for me. So it, I'm still enjoying it. I think I'm appreciating it more this time around because I'm not as jaded about it. Um, but we were, we had just left the first planet and we're getting to like the main setting of the story by the time I stopped. So... I didn't get any footage of walking around Helen because there were so many people, but it was nice. And then I did stop at the um, little farmer's market that I stopped at last year, but it was another case where there were like 8,000 people and I didn't want to film anything. And I had left Peach in the car, so I was like doing a really, really quick run in, grab some pumpkin bread and banana bread and apple cider and run out, which I should probably show you. So let's go. She is so sleepy now. Yeah, I got some pumpkin bread, some banana nut bread, which is like my all-time favorite thing, and then some chocolate little nut fudge because I was really craving like some fancy fudge. I also got three postcards, they all look the same. Um, I'm going to send two to my grandmother's and then one to a Frank Turner postcard exchange group I'm part of. So yeah. yeah. And then I also got some cider. I might steal a cup of it, but it's for my Halloween party that I'm having next weekend. This is Peach's plan for the fall weather. My dog. Somebody explain. You are such a mess. So her favorite thing in the entire world is brown paper bags and cardboard. So I'm going to give her her favorite thing in the entire world. And we shall see what she decides to do with it. It might not be that climactic because she is like so tired. You like your bag? You like your bag? But yeah, I think I might leave this video here just because I'm probably just gonna crash the rest of the day and um not do a whole lot else. I might try to read some more, but I was actually thinking about switching back over to the Dresden Files because I started that the other day. And spoiler alert, I'm loving them. <laughs> out of nowhere, I just picked that. And you'll find out more about that in my October wrap up, which will be coming at the end of this week. But yeah, so waiting on some Arby's to arrive. I might crack into this banana nut bread and well have a good afternoon hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did feel free to like comment or subscribe anyway i hope you all are having a wonderful weekend hopefully the weather's as nice for you as it is for me and you guys are getting to do plenty of fall things let me know down below what all you're looking forward to about this fall season and i'll see you soon with another video bye